going on guys? Beats here and welcome back to another video. Today's video is different than most videos you've seen on the channel so far, like emulated gameplays or vlogs. Today is actually an unboxing video, because the package, the package of the century, has finally arrived. Now I've talked about this in more recent videos, but I finally ordered a MOGA controller for my Android games, so the uh, quality of the game would be better. So without further ado, we're going to do the unboxing boxing of the MOGA. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have a tripod stand to like record me actually unboxing it. So rather that, I'm just going to skip to the part where it's all out of the packaging. So I'll see you in the next clip. Anyways guys, we got the uh, MOGA out of the box. It also came with a Bluetooth pair of headphones that I ordered in order to make my uh, mic quality better. So here's the box, obviously, you know, get rid of that. So there's the MOGA. Let's take a look at the packaging on it. So you got the MOGA Game On Emulator Console Quality Gaming for your Android phone or tablet. It also comes with Pac-Man. And you can get a free download of Sonic CD. And that's the controller itself. Okay, it looks like it got an award at E3 for the best hardware by Machinima. So that's the MOGA. And these are the pair of Bluetooth headphones I've ordered. Just for my, uh, just a couple of J-Buds with the uh, Bluetooth headset in them. You know, to make the quality better. So, uh, without further ado, let's get into actually opening up and showing off the MOGA. Guys, are this is the MOGA out of the package. As you can see, it's about as big as my hands with, uh, you know, standard. It's supposed to be not too big, but it's just enough to get, like, both hands around it. As you can see, it's a standard size controller with two analog directional sticks, A, B, X, Y, start, select, and a power button. Uh, right here, you can flip this up, and this is where you would put the phone up on here, which this actually extends upwards to fit most phones, and that's how you'd play the device as well. And then if you flip it over in the back, it looks like right here and here are where you're going to add the batteries. Two, uh, you're going to need a, a dub, uh, AAA for here, AAA for here, so two AAAs all together. So that's the controller, that's basically everything you got to do. And now to get the controller to work with games, it gives you like a step-by-step -step manual, so you have to download the Pivot app, uh, put the batteries in, install the device, and then pair it with the device, pair the device with the game, and then uh, you should should be all set. It's got to be MOGA compatible though, which most games are, like most GBM their games are, so we'll be good on that. And like I said, those are just a uh, pair of Bluetooth headphones to, you know, not record the button mashing when it's that close to the speaker. So that's my MOGA unboxing, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to be ready to, because I'm going to be using this every time I do a MOGA gameplay review, or a uh, GBA gameplay review. So uh, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, this might cut to a uh, video preview of using the MOGA. So uh, stay tuned for that. Anyways guys, I'll see you in the next clip. So anyways guys, this is gameplay of me using the MOGA for the first time. Obviously I'm going to be on Doom, so let's take a look at this. Uh, let's just... Okay, so you still have to do the same. I mean, it's a lot easier to do. Definitely it's a lot easier. It's not horrible. I'd say it's better. It's definitely way better. It just sucks though, because one analog stick controls all the movements again. Yeah, these guys. This is a lot better, definitely, than last time. Sit down, child. I have to like somehow jump onto that. Ooh. Alright, well, this is the preview gameplay, obviously. So, let's do my final review on the MOGA. That's the MOGA. 
that is definitely the Moga. The greatest. That's actually really good. Um, I just have to set up the keying, unfortunately, because, like, uh, me and Goofy were talking. For some reason, B is A, A is B. And, like, for Doom, I want to set it up so both analogs work rather than just one doing all the work. But all in all, it's definitely a really cool device. I'm really glad I got it along with these new Bluetooth headphones. Hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing preview. I'll see you guys in the next video.